Hey, Lucas. Long time no see, man. Hey, Jonah. Didn't we talk over Discord last night? Um... Anyway, we got two great videos for you this week. One about staying active over the break. And the other is about mountain biking. Stay, Stay tuned, tuned for, for the, the forecast. forecast. Dude, John, I am so bored. Do you have any ideas for me not to die of boredom? I mean, I don't, but Ashlyn might. Hey, Eastview. So I know since we're all doing distance learning right now, a lot of our sleep schedules have changed quite a bit. So I decided to ask some Eastview students how theirs has changed. So I typically go to bed around 10 or 10.30 and then I wake up at 8 or 8.30. Since distance learning has started, I've been going to bed around like 3 a.m. every night. And then I normally wake up around noon. I usually get to bed somewhere between midnight and two in the morning. I have typically been waking up like pretty consistently at 7.30 without setting an alarm. Although today I did sleep until nine because my family has gotten into a pretty bad habit of staying up until around midnight. This has changed a little bit due to distance learning since obviously we don't start school at 7.30 anymore. So I am able to sleep in a little bit longer. And this is very different from like when I was going to actual school because I would normally go to bed around like 11 or 11.30 and then wake up, wake up around 6.30. I used to have a really strict routine. Like I'd be in bed and awake by a certain time every single day. But now that I don't have any classes to go to, um, there's like not a real point in me keeping that routine anymore. Hey Lucas. I heard you've been mountain biking more over the break. Yeah, I have been, but Braden knows more about that. During this period, where we are not able to hang out and see friends as we used to, many people have been going to Lebanon Hills. Lebanon Hills mountain biking trails are open year-round and are home to many racing teams. However, they have seen heavy use over the last few months. Many people, including kids and high schoolers, have been taking advantage of these trails, including Eastview's junior, Sam Kanopic. Yeah, so I've been coming to Lebanon this year since quarantine started about three times a month. The parking lots have been packed day and night with people enjoying the many mountain biking trails Lebanon has, from beginner to expert. Since you are apart from other riders, this has become a great way to stay active and hang out with your friends. Uh, it's a great activity, especially for social distancing, because you're on the trail, you're biking around, you know, you're more than six feet away from the other people, so... Signing out for the forecast, this is Brayden. And now, it's time for everyone's favorite. It's written fact time. Did you know that 19 million people use Discord daily? And there could be more now because of the outbreak. Well, I know I've been using it more. It's all we have for today, Eastview. Thanks for watching.